Hi everybody, I'm Morgan Holt. Welcome to the first episode this year of Between the Lines, showing you what's happening around campus at Red Lion Christian Academy. The first day of school on August 25th was an exciting time for students who got to catch up with their friends and teachers. My first day was pretty good. It was nice seeing all my friends and catching up with them. And I think my first, my hardest class this year is definitely going to be pre-calc. And the class that I enjoy the most will most definitely be English. It'll be engaging and exciting. Yeah, good stuff. I'm afraid of sports. I do that too. That's like trying to find her. Yeah, Bob. Bob. Mm -hmm. In this. First day of school was really good today. We started out with devotions. We all got introduced to the school again. And then we all had our individual classes. And those all went well. Some of them we started right in, and others we just went over the syllabus. The number that I have written down. Because they don't like what they drew. What was the first one? This first day of school, it was kind of exciting. It felt like I never left. Like everything was back into the normal groove and everything. Swing of things. Does martial arts? Okay. First day of school is always a lot of fun, and my voice was feeling it because I was talking all day and singing. But I think it's going to be a really good year. Lots of good kids in choir. Lots of good kids in band. I'm excited. I just finished my first day of school here and I thought it was pretty fun. I got to see my friends again and ha hang out with them. As a teacher it's been exciting to see all the new faces and to help lots of students find the classrooms as they've been switched around. Alright, so today's our first day of school. It's been good so far. Uh, it was great seeing all my friends. Um, I can't wait to see what this uh, year has in store for us. On August 28th, the high school enjoyed an early day away from school at North Bay Retreat Center in Northeast Maryland. The one-day retreat was a time to concentrate on the Word of God through praise and worship, biblical teaching, and small groups. There was even a time for some fun and games. We're here at North Bay and the retreat's going really well so far. It's a beautiful day outside and the place is amazing. Uh, the speaker I'm really enjoying. We're able to just look at how God loves us so much and His glory is just made known to us. The worship's also really amazing and after that we broke up into small groups which is really cool to get together with the girls in our grade and just exp like open up with each other which I'm really looking forward to throughout the rest of the day as well. The opening of the new Redemption Church, pastored by our very own Mr. Daquan Gibson, was on Sunday, September 7th. Close to 150 people gathered in the sanctuary for worship and a message. Father, we thank you for this time and this opportunity to lift up your name, to worship you. And God, we pray that with all of the fanfare, with everything that is happening in this joyous occasion, we pray that we do not lose sight of the fact that you take pleasure in the worship of your children.
And me and my family, we have been welcomed here, and we enjoy it here. This place is like no other. Redemption always carries with it the concept of going from something to something. So these pallets aren't just a wall decoration, they are our story. They are the story of redemption. And before he gets home, his father sees him in the distance and runs to him with open arms. And his father gives him a robe and he gives him a ring and he reinstates him as a part of the family. The young people that we have that have been a part of this church plan is amazing. It, it blows my mind. Now unto him who is able to keep you from stumbling and to present you blameless before the presence of his glory with great joy to the only God, our Savior, through Jesus Christ our Lord, be glory and majesty and dominion and authority before all time, now and forever. Amen. Amen. The sports teams are already in full swing. Check out the sports schedules online at redlinesports.com and cheer on the Lions to victory. The 2014 yearbook has arrived. If you did not pre-order, you can still purchase a book in the upper school office for $75. Get one now before they're sold out. Next Tuesday, September 17th, is school picture day for the upper school. I'm Morgan Holt, and that's what's happening between the lines.